card number 35. John Point Dexter. Findings. Findings. Nothing to see here, gang. John Point Dexter. Card number 35, National Security Advisor, John Point Dexter. Vice Admiral John M. Point Dexter served as President Reagan's National Security Advisor from December 1985 through November 25, 1986. He was known throughout his Navy career as an officer with a photographic memory who kept his superiors well informed. Point Dexter testified that he had made a very deliberate decision not to ask the president about the division uh, diversion of miss, missile profits to the Contras in order to provide some future deniability for the president if it ever leaked out. He further stated that Reagan would have approved if he had been asked. The following day, after Reagan announced that he would not have approved, Point Dexter explained that that is the whole idea of deniability. <laughs> Point Dexter testified concerning Oliver North activities, see card number 13, that I never believed that the Boland Amendment ever applied to the NS. C staff. This odd interpretation of the Boland Amendment by which Congress had meant to cut off all military aid to the Contras was supported by Edwin Mee, Mees, the President's legal advisor, C card number 33. Point Dexter, uh, Point Dexter repeatedly lied to Congress about NSC's role in helping the Contras. Like North, Point Dexter destroyed piles of documents, including, including, he said, the only copy of the presidential finding retroactively authorizing missile sales to Iran and characterizing these sales as a straight arms for hostages swap. In 1988, John Point Dexter was in, indicted, indicted for defrauding the U.S. government uh, and obstructing justice. John Point Dexter.